ndugu zangu leo tuko katika kituo cha uwekezaji Tanzania na leo hii tumepokea ugeni mkubwa ugeni ukiwa umeongozwa na balozi uh, wa nchi ya Uswizi hapa nchini na ameongoza delegation ya taasisi inayoitwa Switzerland Global Enterprise lakini pia kuna taasisi yao nyingine inaitwa Swiss Business Hub ambayo yenyewe makao yake makuu yako Afrika ya Kusini wako hapa kimsingi kujifunza eh, kwa lengo la kujifunza fursa mbalimbali ambazo zinapatikana nchini eh, kwenye sekta zetu za kiuzalishaji za utoaji wa huduma ili sasa waweze kwenda kuhamasisha eh, wafanyabiashara na wawekezaji ambao wako Uswizi kuja kuwekeza hapa nchini wao wanajinadi kuwa eneo lao kubwa nchi kama Switzerland ambao ni nchi ndogo wameweza kufanya au kupiga hatua kubwa ya maendeleo kwa kutumia wafanyabiashara na wenye viwanda wadogo na wakati kitu ambacho na sisi ndicho tunakipigia upatu kwa maana kama taifa tuna sera maalum ambayo inasimamia biashara ndogo na zakati kwa hiyo kwa upande wao wangependa kuona ni fursa zipi nchini ambazo wawekezaji na wafanyabiashara wao wanaweza kuja nchini kushirikiana na wafanyabiashara nchini ili kuweza kuzitumia ipasavyo fursa hizo kwa ajili ya kulisha soko letu la ndani lakini pia kusafirisha baadhi ya bidhaa kupeleka kwao kwa sababu wao hawana uwezo mkubwa wa uzalishaji hususan kwenye bidhaa kama za chakula lakini pia katika huu mkutano wa awali wameonyesha kuwa na nia ya kuweza kuvutia uwekezaji kwenye masuala ya uendelezaji wa nishati masuala ya utalii masuala ya usafirishaji hapa nchini na pia huko mbeleni pengine wanaangalia kuwa na uwezekano wa kuanzisha ofisi maalum hapa nchini sisi kama serikali tumependekeza na wao wameridhia kuwa na makubaliano maalum ya kuunda chombo maalum sasa ambacho kitakuwa kikisimamia mashirikiano baina yetu hii ikiwa ni pamoja kutangaza fursa lakini pia kuratibu wafanyabiashara kutoka Uswizi kuja nchini na wakwetu kwenda kwao kubainisha au kutambua fursa lakini pia kujenga mashirikiano ya kujenga uwezo wa kimasomo uwezo wa kufanya kiufundi kwa sababu wenzetu kama tunavyofahamu wamepiga hatua kubwa katika eneo hilo. Kwa hiyo kwa ufupi hilo ndilo ambalo tumekutana nalo hapa na sisi kama serikali hususan kupitia kituo cha uwekezaji tumewapa ahadi na tumeonesha nia yetu na dhamira kwamba tutaendelea kufuatilia hichi tulichokubaliana hapa ikiwa ni pamoja na kuwapa miradi yote ya kimkakati ambayo sasa hivi tumeshaiandaa mahususi kwa ajili ya kuitangaza kwa wawekezaji ili na wao wakaitangaze kwa upande huo mwingine. Lakini pia tumewaahidi zipo juhudi kubwa ambazo wizara, serikali na kituo cha uwekezaji inafanya ikiwemo kupitia sheria na sera ya uwekezaji nchini, lakini pia tunaanzisha mfumo maalum wa kimtandao ambao utarahisisha kwa kiasi kikubwa uh, shughuli zote za urahisishaji, usajili mpaka uwekezaji hapa nchini. Kwa hiyo hayo yote tumewaambia tutaendelea kushirikiana nayo na kuwapa taarifa kadri siku zinavyoendelea. Asante. We are here and we are very grateful to our Tanzanian um, colleagues. We had a very very good meeting. We are here with the delegation from Switzerland to uh, to look at ways to improve uh, and intensify economic relations and, and, and investments and, and business activities, Swiss business activities in, in Tanzania. Tanzania and Switzerland have been uh, long-standing long partners already, um, but uh, in the development cooperation um, 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 sphere mostly, and we want to take those relations to the next, uh, to the next level. We already have a Swiss business community, which is quite uh, active here in the, in the country, and we, are, we know of the potentiality of the, of the country, we know of the possibilities. We also pay close attention to the positive developments that are taking place in the country. And we really hope that we can uh, attract more Swiss investors, more Swiss business people in Switzerland for the greater benefit of our two countries and our two, our two people. Thank you. Your Excellency, have you watched I have. And uh, what do you say? Very nice, very impressive. I must say, or I'm proud to say that I have been to many of those places that the president visited herself. Uh, very nice, and uh, and I, I trust that it will uh, it will uh, um, enhance further the the very good image and reputation of Tanzania, which is definitely a country that one should visit once at least in uh, in one's life. Thank you very much. My name is Stefan Barnum from Switzerland Global Enterprise. Switzerland Global Enterprise is the official export and investment body from, from the Swiss government. Um, and we are proud to, to look for um, new possibilities, new opportunities for 
Swiss um, industries uh, to come abroad. And we have been uh, very much impressed about the vibrant uh, Tanzania environment for business. And um, we are here on a fact-finding mission that was actually planned already two years ago. But because of the pandemic, we had to postpone that. But we are very, very much convinced that we are coming at the right time because uh, the, the new reforms, the, the new structures, the business opportunities are, are very, very good matching the, the competencies of, of the Swiss uh, environment. So we are going back and we are making some noise about uh, Tanzania and um, we are hopefully coming back with a couple of um, innovative Swiss companies um, to, uh, to be able to address uh, very important topics like in agriculture or also in other domains where we are able to make a difference. So I think it was a, a very prosperous, very uh, fruitful visit here in Tanzania and thank you very much for having hosted us. And Shukuru mweshimiwa barozi wa uswisi nchini Tanzania. Kini pia kumshukuru naibu katibu mkuu na usika na uwekezaji. Uh, kuja na wageni hawa. Mekwa nafasi nzuri kwa kituo cha uwekezaji kueleza fulsa balibari za uwekezaji zilizopo hapa nchini. E, Lakini pia kuwapa mungozo na muna ambavyo wanaweza wakaleta uwekezaji. Na kimsingi wamefahamu ya kuwa kituo cha uwekezaji ndiyo lango la wawekezaji. Kwa hiyo uwekezaji kwanza hafiki hapa atapewa miongozo yote na kuelekezwa kila mahali anapotaka kwenda. Lakini la msingi zaidi lingine ni kukubaliana ambayo tumesema kuwa tunahitaji wanahitaji kufungua chamber ya Commerce Industry and Agriculture ya hapa hapa nchini. Na hili wamesema watalifanyia kazi kwa haraka ili kuhakikisha kwamba unakuwa na mahusiano ya karibu na ushirikiano. Kwa hiyo ni fursa nzuri sana ambayo tunategemea tutaendelea kufuatilia kwa kadri ambavyo wameeleza na sisi tumepata contacts zao na tutafanya kwa karibu hii kuhakikisha kuwa haya yote ambayo wameahidi yanafanyika kwa wakati. Asante sana.